come to you and thank you. As for Harare province, first and foremost, we just want to thank Zimbabweans and specifically Harareans for exhibiting a high level of political maturity in this election. The environment is generally uh, calm and at the moment it remains calm, sir. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. Um, as the Zimbabwe public policy, we want to urge all Zimbabweans, especially the Harareans, uh, to, make, to make sure that they maintain the peace that is prevailing, the peace that we enjoyed uh, as we move towards the elections, during the elections. And we also expect that this should continue even after elections. So I want to urge everybody to ensure that we maintain this peace until the results are announced. And then we will be we'll for joining our lives in the world and our lives. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Commissioner. Uh, at the moment, as a province, we had about 10 wards that had an extension in voting from yesterday due to some technical glitches that we experienced with the local authority ballot papers. Now all voting uh, is done in the province. Those who wanted to cast their votes, they've done so. The last ward, which is Ward 16 in Harare West, they've closed voting at um, 15, 1,500 hours. So now the activities in those specific wards is that they are now beginning to do the counting process from counting uh, after collecting their results at uh, polling station level, the results will be taken to the wards collection centers where after again collecting all the polling stations within the respective ward, the duly elected councillor will then be declared. Uh, from there, the results will then move to the constituency command center for the respective wards uh, in the constituencies for them to, come to collect further until they declare the National Assembly member would have been duly nominated in this election. So at the moment, collection is now at different stages in our province, starting at the wards, and some uh, collection is now being done at constituency command centers. So what we have at the moment is that for Harare municipality, we have seven wards, we have councillors who have been duly nominated after collection at that level, which is the ward level. Um, uh, Epworth local board at the moment we have three out of seven ones that have, have candidates who have been duly elected in the poll and for Chitumbi is a municipality we are now sitting at 20 wards with elected councillors who have been duly nominated out of the 25 wards that make up Chitumbi is a municipality. Uh, for the National Assembly at the moment as a province we've got two National Assembly uh, constituencies, Mabuku Tafara, the candidate has been duly nominated uh, as member of parliament and again in Chitungwiza we have one constituency which is St. Mary's which also has one candidate who's been duly nominated. So far this is how where we are as a province but collations at different stages are taking place across the province.